welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Anna and today I have another sellers haul for you guys and as you guys can tell I am prepared for Valentine's Day I did get a lot of messages recently these last couple weeks saying hey are you gonna do anything from Valentine's Day a lot of shops usually do I honestly wasn't planning on doing anything for Valentine's Day just because to everyone's point a lot of shops were doing it so I just didn't want to do what everybody else was doing but then I did take a poll on Instagram a lot of you guys really wanted to see some Valentine's Day like boxes put together like I did the Christmas boxes so I decided okay all right I hear you guys so I did put together some Valentine's Day boxes for you guys all at different price points and if you guys don't know just like the Christmas boxes the Valentine boxes are discounted so they are bundles of three or more and they are all discounted just so you guys are aware I just do these bundle deals when I do these boxes so if you ever see Christmas boxes mystery boxes just any type of holiday boxes usually they are discounted boxes so you're not paying full price for all the items in them you are getting them at a discount so that's what I I will start out with and then I did get a lot more new goodies to show you guys along with the Valentine's Day boxes I also do have some new goodies that I am uploading this week as well so let me start with the Valentine's Day boxes and then I will get into the rest so these boxes are usually intuitively selected so they just could be at random because it is Valentine's Day I try to be more mindful so I did put more hearts some teddy bear items some rose carvings just to make it a bit more more for Valentine's Day so I have a few different options so these smaller options I do have some amethyst hearts with some different towers as well as these beautiful rose carvings I have some lapidolite roses I have some labradorite roses so again this was all intuitively done intuitively picked so I do have some smaller boxes some more larger items so then another set of three I want to show you guys I did also put some jewelry pieces together as well I just didn't have so many boxes to show you guys. I just had a few little decorative boxes. So here is another set. It's this really cute flower agate teddy bear, a rose quartz bracelet, a rose quartz tower. You know, again, I just try to be mindful for Valentine's Day and things that people would get for people, like their Valentine. So I just thought these were so cute. I really tried to aim for more hearts, more bears, rose carvings, things like that, just because it makes sense for Valentine's Day. And then another set of three I want to show you guys. I did mix a lot of bracelets, pendants, a lot of hearts, just a lot of different, just a little bit of everything, you know, to give you guys some options and some variety. So I do have some items like this where you get a bracelet, a heart, as well as a beautiful pendant. Again, they are all different. So please, if you guys are interested, check out my Etsy because they are all posted on there. So I do do the first picture is usually of the item all in the box and then the second picture I just have all of the items in the box separately laid out so you can see what you guys are getting now along with like the smaller little boxes I also did some bigger boxes for you guys and again it is Valentine's Day so of course I stay true to that I did put some heart sets together we have some flower agate fluorite beautiful aura hearts a beautiful flashy labradorite heart now again it is Valentine's Day so I really did stick with the theme of heart and just something cute and then here is another one with a lot more heart options so we have some golden healers some moss agate petrified wood labradorite amazonite ocean jasper and howlite how cute are these and these beautiful boxes i just thought such a great idea again i wasn't really keen on doing anything really for valentine's day but so many of you guys when i did the poll on instagram i think it was an overwhelming majority i think 96 percent of you said you want to see some valentine's day boxes so i thought you know what why not i have a ton of hearts i can just put some really cute sets together and yeah we just got some really cute sets for valentine's day valentine's is in february so you still have the sometime it is the end of january but if you do order them this weekend they will get to you by mid to early next week so you will definitely get them in before valentine's day if any of you guys are surprising anyone or a significant other i actually believe it or not have a lot of men that shop with me and i think that's actually really cool because i think the crystal business you kind of feel like it's 
overwhelmingly a female dominated type of area but believe it or not there's a lot of men getting into the business a lot of men that collect and i think that is just really really awesome so you guys if you want to surprise your wife your husbands any significant others i have some valentine's day boxes so definitely go check those out and then let's get into the new items so i did get some really cool sphere holders and carvings in and i do have some more on the way just because i do want to change it up i don't want to keep off Offering the same things over and over so when I do see new items I tend to snag them up for you guys because yeah I just you know I don't want to keep offering the same things so if I see something new I tend to grab them so the first thing I want to show you guys look at how cute these elephant sphere stands are tell me this is not the most adorable thing I absolutely love them they are so cute and then i love this beautiful gold detailing on them it's just oh how freaking cute now i already posted them i already have had a few takers on these they are so cute so if they do sell out i will definitely get more because i think they are so adorable and then with that i also got these really cool buddha heads and also just so you guys do know i do have actually bigger ones on the way as well but i did get my first order i got these smaller ones just to see how they looked and if i like them and you guys i'm obsessed i ended up keeping i have like a pair of the wood and the ceramic just kind of everywhere around the house i think i kept like three pairs of these because i just thought they were so freaking cute so let me show you guys these are about a little over two inches tall so let me show you so this is the ceramic one very cute and then we also do have a wood one this would focus i know it's kind of washing out a little bit because it is darker it is more of like a cherry wood color but how absolutely gorgeous now i do have bigger and when i mean bigger i mean bigger i have like pieces that are five times bigger than these coming in as well but i just thought these smaller ones were really cute again i try to be mindful of budgets you know i know when i was a collector i didn't have a ton of money so i really appreciated shops that had smaller options and some mini options because again obviously the bigger things can get more expensive so i did get the minis in but don't worry if you guys are interested i do have bigger ones coming in as well the next thing i want to show you guys are these really cute dyed agate butterflies now i do have some more butterflies coming in some different colors i also have some natural agate butterflies coming in so you guys might be what do you mean by dyed and what do you mean by natural so usually agates don't come in these very deep blue green purple orange whatever the case they usually don't come in these really deep colors they come in more natural tones right so more natural browns oranges blues grays blacks things like that these right here are dyed agate so i just want you guys to be aware they are treated they are dyed because naturally agates don't really come in this color they're more of a natural blue gray so on and so on so i did want to put that out there i did label that on etsy as well just so you guys are aware that they are dyed but nevertheless they are so cute i did have some takers already that already bought a few of them i just think they're really cute i kept one of every color because i just i don't know i really love them i remember way back when when i was a collector i only saw one person with these butterflies and i was obsessed and i bought so many for myself and then finally my vendor had these butterflies and i was like oh i need them i need them i need them because i remember the live that i was in when i bought them they went so quick they went so fast everyone loved these i love these so i was so excited when the vendor got them in now they are all in gold but how beautiful every butterfly is different each one of them has different designs let me show you guys i love these beautiful pink ones as well some of them do have druzy pockets in them just absolutely stunning and gorgeous and they are listed on etsy and they are numbered so you guys can pick which ones you like i do show a picture of each one so you can see how different each one is so you can select the exact one you would like off of my etsy oh how cute now again i did put in an order for some natural ones as well because maybe not necessarily everyone wants the dyed ones so i just want you guys to be aware that i have those as well coming and then these beautiful black ones i love how the gold stands out with the black 
oh just like the craftsmanship so freaking gorgeous i love it just really really beautiful and again i think these items are also really great for kids you know i know a lot of people actually do shop with me and shop for children nieces nephews whatever the case may be so i do like to be mindful of that so i do try to get some crystals here and there that are kind of you know kid friendly and can be for kids as well right because you don't want to just give them spheres and towers i think these carvings are just a really great way to get kids into crystals if that's something that you're aiming for so yeah so i just got some of those because i thought they were super super cute now let me show you guys these now i am so drawn to this i don't know why but i saw my vendor had these and i just Oh, I fell in love with them and I did keep one for myself because I just thought they were so gorgeous. Now I do have one that is actually a chip resin um, carving like this, but I don't have like a crystal carving. So when I saw them in crystal form, I just had to get them. So if you guys don't know, these are fluorites and I just wanna show you, these are so gorgeous and detailed. Let me get a bit of a close-up for you guys. Just look how beautiful this is. So they are a mix of both green, purple, and a little bit of blue in them. But the craftsmanship, I mean, I don't know why. This, I just was so drawn to it when I saw it. I just think it is so beautiful and so well done. And actually recently I've seen like a lot of candles of like the female body and stuff like that all over my Instagram and Etsy. And I thought those were really cute. So when I saw these crystal ones, I was like, oh my God, I need them. They are just so beautiful. I just, I really, really appreciate amazing craftsmanship. If you guys don't know, um, a little fun fact about me, I actually really wanted to study architecture in college because I usually travel once a year with my parents just to different countries. So I was very cultured in a way because I got to experience a lot of different cultures and art and everything like that. And my mom is a big like museum goer. So she always went to museums. So when I was younger, I really fell in love with things like art, architecture, and things like that. So anything that's like sculpting, artistic, things like that, I am really, really drawn to. So when I saw those, I had to pick them up because I just thought, oh my God, the craftsmanship that goes into these is so amazing. It's just like, I could not pass it up. And I had to show you guys and get a few for you. So I really hope you guys like those because I really thought they were cute when I saw them and I had to get them. Now, the next thing I want to show you guys, which I am so excited, I actually ended up finding some petrified wood bowls now they are a bit more on the pricier side and I will show you guys why because as you can see they are super thick but so gorgeous I did end up keeping a piece for myself that I throw my keys in and it's kind of on my table right when you walk in and it's just it's such a beautiful statement piece I absolutely love petrified wood so let me show you guys here is the first one they are so gorgeous now it is about the size of both of my hands they are pretty big but they aren't large i don't want you guys to be expecting them to be like extremely big they aren't like i can pick them up with no issue they do have a lot of weight to them but it's not bad at all they do have that indent in the middle so you can throw some things in here either some decor items your keys maybe some jewelry pieces but you guys look at this beautiful bark oh it is gorgeous. Now, if you guys don't know, petrified wood is actually real wood that over many, 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 many years has turned into stone because it's been left alone, untouched, and it just crystallized into actual stone. So it's just, it's so beautiful. It really like connects you with like nature and the outdoors. That's why I'm really attracted to petrified wood. It is just so gorgeous. So I'm so happy that I was able to get these beautiful bowls in. I also have some slabs coming in that are just like this. This, so they're cut like the bark i did have some spheres before i had some hearts i didn't have too many takers for those so i decided to get more like natural and barky petrified wood that's what i call it barky because <laughs> it actually looks like tree bark like naturally how you would see it in the woods or something like that now look at this one now this one is a bit darker it has some more yellow and brown tones absolutely stunning here is like a natural indent of the actual bark Again, it is just so gorgeous and it is so 
mind-blowing that nature and earth just does this itself even crystals in general the fact that we even have crystals and the fact that it's just made by earth and mother nature is just it really blows my mind that such beautiful things are made by this earth it's just oh you guys so stunning now they are raw on the back so they aren't polished but the front is polished it does have that indent so you can put something in it again just a really really cute bowl now if these do sell out i will definitely get more i just didn't know how many takers i would have because again as i mentioned the spheres that i had before didn't do so well like they kind of sat around nobody was really interested so i wonder if you guys would be interested in these if they do sell out i would definitely get more don't worry just because i really love these bowls i think they are really cute and if you guys are interested in bigger bowls let me know but just know that when i do ship them out they are going to have a good amount of weight to them so they are going to be pretty pricey because they are bowls and then they're also going to be a bit expensive to ship because they are pretty heavy but again if you guys are interested i will track them down and i will definitely get them for you now the last thing i want to show you guys is actually something very new to me that i actually have never seen before in my life and i haven't seen any other shops kind of have them i don't know if it's a new up and coming thing i don't know if it's like something that just you know it comes here and there i've just never seen them before and when i saw that my vendor had these i was actually really impressed because i thought these were so freaking beautiful that i had to get some for the shop again this is not something that i've seen before in other shops but i was just really intrigued when i saw these i thought it was so beautiful so as you can tell i have some new towers and spheres back here and these are actually called banded agate and it was interesting because when i first saw them they almost reminded me a little bit of like ocean jasper just because they kind of have like pastel -y colors but it does have a lot of white it does have a lot of like browns and grays as you guys will see they are actually agates and i just thought these were so amazing because i've never seen something like this and i did of course you know me so i did end up keeping a tower and a sphere for myself because obviously <laughs> i have no self-control and i can't control myself but i just thought these were so beautiful that i had to get them in the shop but i didn't know how well they would do so what you see here is all that i have if it does sell quick i will try to get more in but i just wanted to show you guys because i was just i was very intrigued it was something new to me that i've never seen before so here they are they are so beautiful and so unique i just oh my goodness it's like how can you not and i love these colors they all range from like white gray to very light blue tones to get pink tones is more kind of on the rare side but i mean you guys this color combo i just i had to get it i just i was obsessed now again i have not seen this before so this is absolutely new to me but i was just oh, i couldn't help myself i was like these are too gorgeous to not take i just i had to get them into the shop and again as i mentioned a lot of them are more brown white and gray tones but nevertheless they are so stunning and you know me i am a sucker for banding like i have that i love banding i don't know what it is but anything that has any type of beautiful patterning or banding on it i'm just so drawn to and then in this tone this kind of like pastel -y white gray tones i just was like oh this is an aesthetic like i love this i have to get these in how gorgeous are these now the towers i feel are definitely a lot more detailed and just really beautiful i just honestly was floored when i saw these oh let me show you guys the towers look at these towers how gorgeous are these these are so stunning oh absolutely love them i didn't even know this was a thing but when i saw these i was like oh, okay i have to get these in now i love this one this one definitely has you'll see it's more transparent the brown and then you have that kind of blue and white banding on it it's just so gorgeous i absolutely love these oh if you ever like thought about a tower that was banded like crazy this would be it like this is kind of like a dream tower of mine because i absolutely love any type of banding on spheres and towers so you guys when i saw these 
I mean, you didn't even have to show me or tell me twice. I snagged them up so quick because I just, how can you not? They are so stunning. Now let me show you these, the last of them. Now again, as I mentioned, this is it. This is all that I do have. I didn't order a ton of these because again, I didn't know how it was gonna do in the shop, but if they do sell out, I can definitely get some more. I feel like this is a newer thing coming onto the market. So I feel like you will see this more often, but maybe not again. I, you know, I can't say for a hundred percent because this is the first time that I've ever seen something like this. And I just was like in love and obsessed with it. So I just thought, I need to get some. I have to have them for my shop because I absolutely love more unique items, especially banded items. You guys know anything banded, shiny, sparkly, that it just calls to me. I just cannot pass up. Like I have to get it in. So that is all that I have for this week's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think about these newer items. If you would wanna see more items like this. Again, I do try to be more unique. I don't wanna keep buying the same things. If I see something new or something that stands out, I really try to jump on it and get it in just cause I do wanna, you know, just offer some more different options to you guys. I don't wanna keep bringing the same spheres and towers your way and I hope you guys really do enjoy the Valentine's Day boxes. Check them out. When I do do boxes, I definitely will have them in the future. I think my Christmas boxes, I can't remember, but I don't think that I did an actual haul of them for you guys for YouTube. I just posted them to Etsy and to Instagram. I can't remember. I would have to look back, um, but I don't remember doing a haul for them. So I will try in the future when I do have mystery boxes, Halloween boxes, Christmas boxes, things like that. I will try to get them in the hauls so you guys can get a better idea of what's in the boxes. And so you guys do know all the boxes that I do are usually discounted. So you are not paying full price for the, anything in the so box. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all the support. None of this would be possible without you. As always, leave any suggestions for things you would like to see in the comment section down below. Until next time, bye guys.